Hi guys, welcome back to Snake Bite. Um, part two. Part two this? of Bearded Dragons. Um, make sure to hit that subscribe button and hit the notifications and hit that bell. Yes. Okay. <laughs> right. I'm just gonna be the cameraman today. Okay. Um. So mom is go my mom is gonna be the one that's doing part two. So go. This is part two of how to care for your bearded dragon. This part is mostly going to focus on loving your pet. Here we have Scarlet, our female leatherback. Really expensive, but she was really cheap. And over here is we have Toothless. He's just a. I think I think he's an Easton um, bearded dragon because Eastons are all black, and he's turning black and gray. So Scarlet, she's kind of our feisty one. She'll calm down in a minute. But basically, oh, <laughs> don't! <laughs> they will jump. Whoops. Basically, what we want to go over is how to love your pet. This lizard may not seem cute and cuddly because it's not furry and warm and soft, but she actually has a really good personality. And she's kind of funny and she entertaining. She wants to eat everything. Cause she's sort of a yeah. pig. She does like to eat everything. She's totally handleable, but she's very, very warm right now. So she's full of spunk and energy. So I she was actually messing around with this string for her. And I was putting it like across the cage. And she was trying to eat it. <laughs> As you can see, the hole on the side of their face, those are their ears. Yep. Only lizards have holes on the side of their face that represent their ears. Snakes do not have ear holes, but they do have ears. They, they, they're they just um, covered up by their scales. And yeah. birds do ha have ears as well. They're just covered up. They look up similar to lizard ears, only covered in feathers. Yes, and scales. <laughs> the more you love your lizard and the more you show it attention and handle it and feed it and love it, the better off. Tuklas is the calm one your animal will be. They can feel it. They have little souls too. Like, He's it. practically holding his head upside down and backwards. That's a really warm light. I'm glad we, we got this kit. Huh, Scarlet? You little bugger. Yes, you beautiful creature. She's you. closed her eyes. She's like... Ah, <sighs> uh, yeah, that gets it. So this concludes our part two <laughs> session. Oh my. Get it. <laughs> Get it. <laughs> He's only getting hold he was just holding on by his tail. Don't give up, little buddy. Try to escape. Anyways, this concludes part two on how to care for your bearded dragons. You have to Showing love them, them love and attention and handling them is the best love and affection you can give to your bearded dragon. Don't forget to hit subscribe and give us a thumbs up and have a wonderful blessed day.